calling me splurge. Let me jump right out the curb. Yeah. Bitch, my feel like a bird. Spin on the first and the third. Yeah. Solid, don't keep in my word. Can't be my equal, I don't know what you heard. Yeah. Crack up the phone, I swear. Keep me a stick if they heard. Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Dorena for those of you that may not know and welcome to a new video. Happy December everybody. Today is the 27th of November but by the time this video goes up it will be December. It is Monday morning. Is this the morning? It's about to be afternoon. It's 11.44 in the morning. I just got home from class. As y'all saw, I picked up Duncan on the way. I got the cookie butter cold brew of course and then I got bagel minis. I was honestly so nervous to see how my drink was going to come out because I could tell it was a new guy. He kept asking how to make certain things but you know we all learn it takes time but it's like with my drink don't mess it up you know but luckily someone that i've recognized and has worked at the dungeon for much longer stepped in and finished my drink it tastes pretty good but yeah i'm just disinfecting all my stuff y'all i have officially entered final season and i'm low-key scared it's just exams exams after exam after exam starting today i need to start studying so that i can pass and the one thing that i don't like i don't know if i mentioned this in one of my past videos for my chemistry class the hardest class that i'm taking this semester we have a third exam and then the final exam and the final is cumulative so it's everything we learned throughout the entire semester and i hate exams like that because i have to basically study every single thing and if y'all remember didn't do well on the first test because i didn't give myself enough time to study and the concepts were very confusing and now i have to go back to square one in order to pass the final these next two three weeks i'm gonna be stressed out of my mind because i just want to make sure that i pass so everyone pray for darina that's the main reason why one of the main reasons why i'm not doing vlogmas this year because i just wouldn't have time for it but we move it is what it is on today's agenda though i really need to finish my notes for amp and then for chemistry that's where we're going to start studying and doing the homeworks and practice stuff but before we do that i need to go ahead and eat breakfast i don't know why though this weekend did a number on me and i didn't expect it to but i'm definitely feeling the aftermath of this weekend my sister's birthday was on saturday we went out you know i wasn't like buzzed or even tipsy really i felt perfectly fine the entire night but i'm starting to feel it now i felt it a little bit yesterday and i'm feeling it definitely right now my endurance is very low and my endurance is typically day-to-day -day basis is already low it seems lower than usual like even walking to school today i was so out of breath which never happens to me especially because i've been going to the gym consistently i haven't felt this way in a long time but i think those drinks i had on saturday are finally catching up to me and the lack of sleep that i've had it's really doing a number on me because right now i feel tired i don't know what it is but well i know what it was but i'm trying to work on that because it's final season i can't be slacking right now but it does suck because it's like i really want to go to the gym today you know it's monday we started off strong but the thing is the way i'm feeling right now is kind of given maybe not i feel like lightheaded a little bit like i said it's just hard for me to breathe so i was just thinking to do something light and walk on the treadmill but i think even that will be a little too much for me so we're gonna see after i eat breakfast we're definitely gonna go tomorrow if i don't go today we're definitely gonna go tomorrow but it sucks because this week i was gonna start using the smith machine i don't think that's the smartest choice for me to do especially going by myself because i won't have anyone to spot me if god forbid i can't pull back up the weight we'll see how i feel after breakfast i'm gonna go ahead and eat breakfast and then make a to-do list of what we're gonna do today one thing that's gonna happen today though or hopefully if i have time is i want to take down my hair it's long overdue it's about time it's coming down today so let's go ahead and eat and enjoy our duncan we like the shorts can we do the shorts yeah my forehead look bigger though Just wanna chill and twist a lot Catch sunks in my 745 You drive me crazy, shorty I need to see you and feel you next to me 
Don't mind Reese's back there. But it is a little later now. It's currently 2.30. Hopefully, I know the lighting is going to change hella during this clip because my TV's on. So hopefully it's not like too distracting. But I just finished my workout. I just did a 10 minute workout because I didn't want to do too much. But at the same time, I still wanted to get my body moving. And it wasn't bad. Like it was pretty nice, pretty chill. Hopefully tomorrow this whole like not really being able to breathe situation gets better so that I can do back and chest. So we'll see how that goes. But at least I was able to work out. Yeah, right now I'm just sitting, chilling. I'm about to make a to-do list of what I want to get done today. I feel like I always make to-do lists and I never actually complete them. So we'll see how well this goes. Today is the 27th. So like I said, general, general chemistry. I wish this was general chemistry because even though it was hard, it was much easier than this freaking organic chemistry. But for chemistry, the one thing I hate with this class is that it's a lot of memorization. I have a decent memory. This man wants us to memorize has like 20 different amino acid structures it's just a lot of structures to actually memorize i don't know i don't know if i'm gonna be able to keep them all in my mind i need to figure out some trick to memorize them because it's like how how so i need to go ahead and write them out because i started it but i didn't write out all of them i need to work on the homework sets because they're due in about two weeks so far we've had two sets of homeworks and for both of them i didn't complete all of them i already know i'm getting a good amount of points taken off because i didn't finish them most of them though i completed to the point where like i was passing them like 65 70 75 so it's not like they were at zero not all of them so this one i want to make sure i complete all the homework sets no exceptions for a p once again the notes i have to do my mastering questions because they're due on wednesday i did one not the other so we're gonna go ahead and hopefully finish the other that's like a good chunk of what the rest of my day is going to consist of i'm gonna hop in the shower and then i will talk to you after currently 508 so it's been a little while since i talked to you not gonna lie it took me a lot longer to actually hop in the shower than it should have but here we are i'm officially in my room i set up my desk and everything like that and we're about to get some of this work done oh i forgot that i finished this book last night honestly i give it like a two and a half out of five stars it wasn't anything magical and it kind of was a drag it literally took me like three weeks to actually finish this book it didn't reel me into the point where i was aching to read it until like the last hundred pages but i ended up finishing it for the hell of it i do need to write in my book journal about that just to document it and i don't forget one thing i forgot to add to my to-do list was to print out my lab i need that for wednesday i think either this week or next week is my last chemistry lab so i'm hoping it's this week and then next week we check out i'm not entirely sure but i have to double check that i'm not gonna lie though i've been putting in so many orders and most of them aren't even for me like it's just my mom getting christmas presents and me basically having to be the one to put in the orders but one thing that i did get for myself today some crocs because it is cyber monday and they had the crocs for like 37 dollars. but on top of that because i have planet fitness and i have the black card i get certain perks and one of those perks was 30 percent off crocs and so the 30 percent off on top of the already discount from cyber monday i only paid 26 dollars for my crocs they are like these i don't even know what color you will call them but they're like very light gray slash white color i'm excited because honestly the crocs that i currently have are black i have a pair that's black and then i have a pair that's gray i never really wear my gray ones and then my black ones i've had for a minute now to the point where they're kind of getting old and you can tell and i was debating whether to just buy myself a new pair of black crocs but i'm like why don't i switch it up and just get a different color i ordered that and it should be coming hopefully by the end of the week i was debating whether to put it under the tree and be surprised on christmas but honestly no <laughs> i'm not going to but yeah so i already know this week as things start coming in it's gonna be a lot of wrapping which i'm not looking forward too but hey we move anyways i'm gonna stop rambling though so we can actually get on with some work i think i'm first gonna work on my amp i'm gonna put on some christmas cafe music in the background and hopefully that can help me focus so yeah these 
these next couple clips is just gonna be probably long montages of me getting this stuff done so sit back relax if you're a college student this is your sign to pull out your notebook ipad laptop whatever the case may be and do some work alongside me we can study together and if you're not in college you know this is just your sign to do whatever productive thing that you've been pushing off for the longest time and let's just zone in together <laughs> I'm so tired right now. Hey everybody, good morning. Right now it is 9.59 in the morning. I woke up like probably 20-30 minutes ago, but now I'm actually fully awake. I can definitely do with another like 2-3 hours of sleep, but I'm really trying to work on my sleep schedule of sleeping early, waking up early. So I forced myself out of bed. I knew if I didn't get out when I did, I would have stayed in bed until like 12 and I can't do that. Here we are. I'm about to start getting ready for the day, you know, brush my teeth, do my skincare, all that good stuff. This this hair is definitely coming down today i know i said yesterday i will keep it in for a couple days but honestly they're not even and most of them keep untwisting like this so i have to keep retwisting them and it's like i feel like i do so many and then there's still some left that's missing it was a cute idea but once i come back from getting my brothers from school this is coming down yeah before i get ahead of myself though let me go ahead and brush my teeth and do my skincare i'm gonna do it off camera because we bought this new shell for our bathroom and the way i would have to set y'all up is so complicated like even now the angle's so high i would have to like tippy toe to be in the center of the screen so i'm just gonna go ahead and do my stuff off camera and then i'll get back to you i'm just chilling in my gym i have a lot of packages coming today most of them are presents that my mom bought for my brothers and my dad and stuff one of them though is an air fryer we finally got an air fryer and i'm honestly super excited about that because with an air fryer you can do so much stuff and i've been wanting an air fryer for a long time because usually when i make stuff i either do it you know with oil on the pan or i'll use my mini oven whatever you want to call it but with an air fryer you know i can start making my waffle fries better i can start making a whole bunch of stuff better i genuinely don't know what's wrong with my voice it might be weird throughout this video because like i said i'm still recovering from this weekend i think i also have stuff coming from uggs which is one of my brother's presents i think a couple stuff from amazon is supposed to come either today or tomorrow i'm about to check my email because i woke up and like three of my stuff was confirmed for delivery and i'm like that was fast what else we got for today's agenda I also have to pick up where I left off yesterday in terms of doing schoolwork because I got a good majority done yesterday. There's still a lot more to go. I'm just proud of myself for pushing myself because I'm like, you're not laying in this bed until you complete so-and-so. And I actually went through this. So many things went wrong 
just getting here it's always like this on tuesdays first off where my car was parked right i had no space in front of me nor behind me to get out so the only way i could properly get out unfortunately was to hit the car in front of me and behind me and obviously it was just a small nudge like i'm not gonna damage someone's car i don't even blame the car that was behind me i blame the car that was in front of me it shouldn't have been there technically there was a fire hydrant right in front of it and it was too close i forget what the legal space is supposed to be i think it's like 10 15 feet i was obviously not fit in there without it being basically right on top of my car I literally had to nudge the car in front of me and the car behind me in order to get out and then come to find out i had no gas in my car whatever it is what it is and then i get here right it's going on 113 115 i get here and basically the parking lot that i gotta go to for the planet fitness there's no parking and people want to be when I tell y'all people was just doing the most, they were just doing the most. I wish I had like built-in camera so I could record the stupidity every single time it happens because it's beyond. I don't understand people sometimes. And so I was just like, you know what? I already knew that I had to come to Target literally to buy deodorant because I don't have my deodorant anymore. I ran out. I've been using a different one and it's honestly not my favorite. The Target that I go to is in the same like area. So honestly, I'm just going to go in here, get the deodorant, and then just come back in my car and chill. I have to catch up on my notes. I did bring my iPad, so I'm just going to do that until my brother gets out because at this point, I'm just too fussed up to even want to go to the gym. I already know I wouldn't have enough time to do my workout because I have to warm up. Then I have to do the actual exercise which is 30 minutes and then I have to do my cool down and by that point it'll be 2 o'clock and then I'll be rushing to get my brothers I'm trying not to let it tear down my mood I'm sorry if I sound like I'm just and complaining it's not that serious but at the same time it is serious but anyways we're gonna go into target we're gonna try to turn this day around so let's just head in here real quick get what we need to get i just wanted to pop in here real quick because after editing this segment i cut out a lot of it because i was like girl you're complaining for what but i genuinely feel like the main reason why i was upset this day was because i'm someone that has truly dedicated a lot of my time and energy to going to the gym and trying to be disciplined and consistent with it that's like the one thing in my life that i can say i truly am disciplined on i like to stick to my schedule and physically go into the gym so this day or this week entirely honestly was so bad for me when it came to the gym because like y'all saw earlier in the video monday i couldn't go because i wasn't feeling the best and then this tuesday couldn't go because people just got in my way and then the rest of the week even though i didn't film it i just couldn't get into the gym until friday because it was just too much going on and i was just frustrated because all i wanted to do was go to the gym and i started feeling the effects of not like sticking to my schedule when it came to the gym because my mental was starting to decline and i was starting to get in my head about things so honestly for me the gym really has become like therapy for me it's really my safe place and my happy place and i don't even really go into the gym to be like oh my gosh an aesthetic girly i genuinely go because it brings me peace and peace <laughs> so i think that's the main reason why i was going on a whole rant and a whole tangent but like i said i cut most of it out because y'all would have been pissed at me just like i'm pissed at myself for how i reacted during the situation so yeah i just wanted to clear that up but um let's get on with the rest of the video why is it literally like flurry literal snow mini snowflakes are coming down i can't even show y'all because y'all won't even really be able to see it because it's so faint y'all already noticed i don't like to drive when it's raining how no do i enjoy driving while it's freaking snowing things just don't work out in my favor on tuesdays but it is what it is i got this deodorant this is just a secret one i heard the secret one is really good i think i tried it out once before but that was before i realized i was allergic to deodorant so this one is actually aluminum free it smells really good the smell is real lavender so we're gonna use this Hopefully it does what it needs to do it's already 1 30 that was a quick trip but i swear time can be the devil sometimes i'm about to head over to my brother's school and find some parking that way i can get some work done and then head back home so yeah let's just make our way
natural. I look like a whole boy right now. I'm finna hop in the shower. I already know the shower's gonna hit because that first shower, after you take down a protective style and you're just getting all that gunk off, feels so good. So I'm gonna talk to y'all after my shower. I'm not even going front. It's been like two hours since I talked to y'all. Hopped in the shower as I told y'all I was gonna do. And then I went to eat dinner and was just watching TV. But yeah, it's like 7, 7.05. About to go ahead and blow dry my hair. I swear it feels so long since the last time I blow dried my hair. It's literally been a month and some change. So we're gonna go ahead and blow dry that. With that being said, I don't want to talk y'all ear off. I'm gonna go ahead and blow dry my hair and then I will show y'all the after result because I don't feel like editing too much, you know? Y'all, I'm looking like a hot mess right now. We're not even gonna talk about it because I just spent the last hour and some change editing this video. But I just wanted to come out here and close out today's video. Don't mind my laptop trying to explode on itself. It is what it is. <laughs> this video, honestly, I don't even really know what to title it or like what to think of it. It was supposed to be day in my life. That kind of turned into like two days in my life because I combined two days. I was gonna also insert footage from an attempted week in the life that I tried to film, but I'm not gonna lie, Loki had a mental breakdown. So I was just like, no, I'm just gonna scrap that video and title. Hopefully you guys still enjoyed this video. Make sure you go ahead and check out my TikTok because I'm doing 25 days of Vlogmas over on there. To do Vlogmas on YouTube, just can't do it. I already explained it, I think. Please bear with me the next couple weeks as I try to get out videos. I have so much on my mind right now with finals. Filming is kind of just non-existent in my brain. So bear with me. Bear with me. I only have like two more weeks or like a week and a half and then I officially am on break for a month. So there's going to be a lot more content after that. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in my next vlog. Mm -hmm.